Amy Medford with Medford Knife and Tool. We're going traditional today with the video. Hi. Pro Source. All right, Paul and Gil, hello, how do you do? They are located in Houston, Texas. Houston, Texas. Address 14911 Stubner Airline Road, Suite A, Houston. Telephone number 281-453-8801. Let's do this. <laughs> All right, man, we don't see very many of these. This is, other than the Praetorian tie, the only knife that is available with a Vulcan blade. It's the ST8. It's got a range finder on it. It has one inch um, tick marks on the back of it so that you can use it as a, as a ruler pretty much. It has the hex screw down at the end. G10 handles, a beautiful Vulcan blade. Just a really utilitarian all around knife that you can use a screwdriver i mean you could use it as a range finder just a fantastic multi-use tool here for a really good price great price st8 vulcan okay let's carry on on belay all pvd'd out except for the breaker and this hardware and clip so tuxedo version it's got the s35 pvd blade handle spring tie clip one infraction in a D2 tumble blade, blue anodized handle and spring. I had uh, posted, no, I might not have posted it yet. I have another video where we talk about carbon fiber versus titanium. And three MIDI Marauders, not the slim MIDI, but the full thickness MIDI, all in S35VN. One with kind of a violet handle and spring. Satin blade. One satin blade with really dark, brooding, flame, swirly coolness on the handle and spring. Oh, not on it. I lied. I lied. Anodized on the spring and the flame clip to complement the handle. You'll notice as we move forward, less and less flaming on the spring as it does um, have a tendency to warp titanium and make it difficult uh, to have it work. Many times we can make it work. Many times we cannot. So you'll see that starting to phase out. And a fully sculpted... Uh, kind of a hammered crater texturing on the whole handle and spring. Uh, very cool muted blue anodization and a satin blade. So all three of these have satin blades. Very classy, very classy sexy knives. Headed out to Paul and Gil at ProSource. It's been a long day already and here we are. It's a Thursday and we're one, two, three, four, five, six days into the teacher strike. We thought yesterday we got an email from the PV school district here in Arizona saying, we're on, we're back in for school. And then, oh, like in the afternoon, a second email saying, nope, not yet. Legislation hasn't done what they want it to do. So another day, here we are, kids out of school, but at least they're at home. Uh, Roxanne is getting a painting lesson. She's painting a barn painting that we're trying to get her to finish. And who knows, Jack is probably just reading a book and hanging out and uh, hopefully not doing TV. Everybody else out there, I hope you have a fantastic day. And Paul and Gil and everybody there at ProSource, I wish you well. And everybody else, till the next time, I'm out.